Marissa? We've got five minutes. Five whole minutes? Five whole minutes? Five minutes? That's pretty good for a round table. It is. <laughs> That's actually very good. Hi. Nice to see you guys. Hello. Hello. Um, I can just jump in. So, first of all, obviously, um, you're coming to the end of the season. And everyone wants to know about the finale. There's been lots of rumours about the season five finale being a series finale. Can you comment about that at all? Um, <laughs> we started that rumor. Yeah. yeah, I think, I think it's okay. I mean, every episode's a serious finale if we don't get to make any more. Yeah. Uh, you know, the way we're approaching it, we're, we're approaching it is, we believe there's always, even at the end of a story, there's always more story to tell, as long as every, the entire universe doesn't disintegrate. So, you know, we want to make it thrilling in case it isn't all. And we approach the end of every season the same way. Which is we never really know if we're going to get another one until we're towards the end of our shooting. Right. Anyway, so our goal is to either be able to, you know, satisfy it by doing We're hoping it's not the series finale. Yeah. <laughs> but we don't. Don't we all? Is there anything particular um, you can say about the season finale today? Any teasers you can give us? Um, no. I mean, we can just say that we think it will be satisfying. Emotional. 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 We try and, every year we try and arc out a, a story that, you know, begins one place and answers all the questions we've brought up. And I think every year, especially this year, we look back more over the last seasons as well. Like in the 100th episode we did, we went back and, you know, try to remind people of some of that. And I, I think that's true as we go forward to the rest of the season. So a Question. lot of, oh, okay. So a lot of people are here at WonderCon come to Comic Con to see you guys, but what did you miss about coming as a fan? Did you used to come before the show or Well, we always every time we've been here it's been with some project, but we also we do come as fans. One of the things that's super fun about any con is and we walk through these halls to get to here and we always are passing other shows and there's this geek fest that happens as you walk by you're like, oh, that's, that's, yeah, that's where from black, you know? <laughs> I fangirl out over anybody that I pass by that I'm, you know, I watch the show. It's very, it's super cool. And I think our first Comic-Con was for Dr. Horrible. And that was the first time we had ever been to a con, so it was sort of a nice intro, having something to show, as well as being huge fans of everyone that we saw passing us by. Yeah. Who would, who would you say is like your number one, like, who would you fan out the most on? Mm. And that goes for all of you guys. Yeah, please I mean, don't look I, them I out. think it, it ebbs and flows. Like, you mentioned Orphan Black because we talked about it. That first season of Orphan Black, we were crossing to Tanya. Tanya Mislana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we all went, oh my god, it's... And we all kind of freaked out about that. I remember one Comic-Con, I was, we were at a party, and we were out on the dance floor, and I turn around, and it's the entire cast of Game of Thrones. And oh I my nearly, gosh, you got your groove on with Game of Thrones? I, yes, I did. I did. And I nearly died. I thought oh, I said wow. it was Loki. No. <laughs> Do you have any dream casting ideas at all? Like, who would you, would you like to have someone like Tatiana Maslany on? Is there someone you really tried to get? A show? So, you know, we've had a, a we have a lot of people on the show this year uh, who are on that list uh, near the end of the year. I think we've been very fortunate with our guest cast over the years. I mean, many of the people, when we realize that they're actually cast, we're like, oh, they said yes. <laughs> okay, great. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I think. Bill Paxton tests will still always be the, the biggest gem because you couldn't believe it. But, you know, writing lines for him. Yeah. Yeah. He is a legend and yeah. he will always be remembered as such. But now it's hard because there's so many TV shows. So you'll, you'll say, oh, we love that guy from that show. And they'll say, yeah, he has two of his own shows. <laughs> um, and then speaking we have time for one more question. I got a question for you. Um, with season five starting in space, at least to begin with, was there ever any thought of referencing the events of the Infinity War? Or, or can you not tell us? We all looked at each other like, what can we say? What can you say? Like, what can you, say? Yeah. <laughs> um, you know, it is one universe, and so the events of that film will affect us. Uh, 
but you know, over the years we've become more separate, or have become sort of our own story. And initially we were really tying in just to sort of branch off of that. But now we're much more interested, and we think it's much more rewarding that we're sort of more self-contained. That being said, you know, we don't venture, we didn't venture into space until the films did. We didn't venture into magic until Doctor Strange. And so they sort of blaze the path, and then we're allowed to play in those new parts of the park. So. Because I heard that um, the Infinity War um, and your sets were kind of crossing over, like, using both. Is that right? There, there's, uh, there's some of that with the films, but we can't really say. Yeah. Neither confirm nor deny. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> no, just speaking of the MCU as a whole, obviously I loved when the Spirit of Ghost Rider came on the screen. Can I expect any other tie-ins with other big name characters? Uh, perhaps. I mean, perhaps again. Can you not say? We cannot say. We're sworn to secrecy. Yeah, we're sworn to secrecy. But we're really good at not answering questions yeah. for a very long time. Excellent. Yeah. Marvelous. Yeah. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you.